Under fire! Taking aim! Charge, guys. Why are you just standing there? There we go. There we go. I use that command power, which is that army staff thing, which is like 400% increased planning speed, so they got rid of that stupid... Um, that uh, minus 20% not, not ready buff that they had or whatever. New York's gonna be. Well, we're we're straight up, we're straight up destroying divisions down here in uh, in Charleston. Good. They're just getting wiped out, or they're leaving. One of the two. Probably wiped out. Uh, I saw the French Navy out here somewhere. The Allies have lost 12.2 million people now. <whistles> We've lost 7.2. We as in collective anti-Allied coalition. That's right, trombone. <laughs> For Bob so hated the enemy, they attacked on all fronts. And Bob saw this was good and continued to attack until the weaker forces finally crumbled under his mighty fist. <laughs> ah! Oh, there's a, there's a color explosion going on here. What are you doing? I just decided to change colors. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I think I think they're just straight up getting destroyed, these divisions down here. Good. Because I realized half yeah, my colors are my usual garrison colors, which is orange. I mean, that or they've much. they've just they've just like fucked off one of the two. Cool. So Charles has been dealt with, and you're dealing with New York. It looks like slowly, slowly. Okay. Oh. Well, what now? <laughs> Here's the 47th Viking Division. I approve. Ooh. Yeah, I'm God's gonna... socialist leader, Bob. Yes, I am. Well, one of them. One of them. It's a committee headed up by myself and mortared Viking. We are entirely equal. Uh, that's how communism Garris works. Garrison. Oh no, the garrison commands bugs, isn't it? Oh wait, no. It looks like it's working. Wait, why can't I garrison Florida? There we go. All right, I'm garrisoning everything that's like Gulf Coast and then Georgia and South Carolina right now, and all the ports. I'm just sitting there cool. until we've got whatever our situation is figured out. <laughs> Mordred. <laughs> I don't know if we really need to garrison up Los Angeles. I mean, the West Coast hasn't not been like molested at all. Yeah, it's all been East Coast. But then yeah. again, maybe better to be safe than sorry. Maybe just a small token garrison. I think it'll be fine. There's been far more action on the East Coast. True. Okay, so what are we in the hole on right now? We are missing 8,500, 600 guns. We were gaining on some of this stuff, so it's good. I imagine we're losing the guns because we're fighting up in the north. Well, kind of. Kind of, but not really. <laughs> Alright, launch the offensive. Oh, since we're actually... Or did we already put those in? We did, we're already producing the M2 carbine. Excellent. Yeah, I changed that a while ago. Excellent. Excellent! What if Ming starts making claims? <laughs> Then World War II got really hairy. That's yeah. all that means. <laughs> yeah, so I've got all the ports garrison now down here in the south, so I think we'll be fine. Yeah, I have... Oh, hey, naval action. Bring it, American Navy! That's not us. I'm amazed that some of those are still alive. <laughs> and then 19 light cruisers showed up. And sunk destroyer, and sunk another destroyer. They have 31 oh, divisions in New York. That's 31 dead divisions in New York. As long as they keep the pressure on, yeah. Because they can't ever reinforce when we can. Let's go! <laughs> Hail Bob and Mordred! That's right, Black Bear Navy! Attention! <laughs> <laughs> 
That's right, Trumbo. That's exactly my thoughts. Bob to the troops. Okay, guys, so you really need to stop letting all the Italians in. I know the meatballs are super good, but we're at war. But, uh, pizza. Oh, yeah, this, uh, this fleet is starting to sink stuff. Of course, the Americans don't have anywhere to, like, hole up and repair except for New York. Anymore, but New York man. is under constant, constant attack right now. Yes, yeah, so they're going to be taking damage to infrastructure and everything. Just got to keep the pressure on. Are there any other civilian factories need repairing? There are. I'm gonna train up some more people's guard. Go for it. I'm just gonna, just gonna put them in the queue, not necessarily... I mean, that can be trained for a while because we don't have any guns to give them, but... Produce two runs of 24 on that. Still a tiny bit of resistance in Canada, but I'm, I have to dispatch some commissars to deal with that. <laughs> Excellent. That's what they're good for. Exactly. Good grief. How are we not taking this place? Well, some of these guys are attacking across a river as well. Yeah, I know. We keep breaking off the attack for some reason. Yeah, it's just whenever morale gets too low. They're doing too much morale damage. But we have a lot of artillery in those units now, so we should be just pounding them into dust. Then, in fact... <laughs> Do we have any strategic bombers? Uh, we gotta have some. We, we were producing them. I am feeling extremely cruel and also extremely proud of myself all at the same time. We have 490 strategic bombers. Why do you want to strategic bomb New York? Because I'm going to destroy we... the port there. Oh. And then they can't supply themselves because there's no port anymore. Okay. <laughs> Just carry on. <laughs> Bomb it, guys. You have your oh orders. Oh my god, they, ah, there they go. <laughs> <laughs> like they're getting air superiority over here somehow. Oh man, look at that. That port just got fucked. Look at that. Oh my god. <laughs> Damage levels four of six on that one pass so far. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, dearie me. Well, did you deploy all 490? You did. Yep. <laughs> oh, my God. Commissar Mordred does not do things by halves. <laughs> no, that's damage level five of six now. Well, one more, one more pass ought to do that, I think. And then those Belgians will rue the day that they ever set foot here. Oh, oh there green. we go. Is it going to be out of supply now? And six out of six damage levels. You've destroyed the port. Keep bombing them. <laughs> right, what other Keep damage can them. I do? Infrastructure? Doubt that New York has any defenses. Right? Ready to serve, my lord. No, it doesn't have any. Is, there's no force or anything there. No. They have an air base though, and they are using that to attack us. So you know what that means. That air base has to go. That is going to be a former air base. I love this targeted bombing system. 
there's more to there's more to Italian cuisine than spaghetti and pizza. I don't know. Ever since the tomato was introduced to Italy, I feel like that they ran with it. You know, I, <laughs> they've embraced it. I Man, something I, I observed to my wife the other day was just like, you know what, Italian cuisine would be very different without the tomato. Dwight Falcon, thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate that. Oh, the uh, host rather. Thank you very much for the host. Appreciate that. And welcome all of his people. Oh man. They keep throwing more and more troops into this place. They're actually trying to attack out from it now. Strangely. Couldn't imagine why. Because there's no port there. <laughs> you blew it up. Oh, did I? Oops. Yeah, it's six to six damage levels. My bad. What do you mean you're bad? You did that on purpose. Okay. I was there. The whole stream <laughs> was there. My stream was there. Your stream was there. We all saw it happen. I mean, all the infrastructure's destroyed. You've now destroyed the... There we go. Uh, the... It's mine. <laughs> it's mine. All mine. Yeah, but after you, you got it after you flattened the place, though. That's... <laughs> The ends justify the means. Oh. Man, so many overruns. Broken. Everything is broken across the country now. <laughs> and there we go. America is American we, once again. We, 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 American. No, no, it's not. It's communist, damn it. <laughs> oh, what decisions do we have here? Well, Bob, we've, success conditions. we've successfully made America great, so it's, it's all good. The job's done. We can end now. We can we can end. We're nowhere near <laughs> being done right now. Right, let's start training all the things. Let's also start spreading you out a bit. So well, I, did, I, I, I queued up 24, 24 runs of, of two already for People's Guard. Yeah, I meant uh, training these units because they're all trained rather than uh, regular. No, don't train them. It's going to take more guns. Don't do it. We have all the industry backs. Fine. <laughs> but everything's broken. We don't have anything. Well, this is just going to, uh, you know, here. motivate the people to get back to bloody work. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and research some more aircraft models here. I think is what we're going to do. Strategic bombers. I quite like them. <laughs> <laughs> and this is when Bomber Mordred became a thing. Bomber Mordred. Bomber Viking. Bomber Viking. People's I like people. it. That's right. You gonna you gonna rebrand yourself as that now? Bomber Harris is nothing on me. Okay, well, how's Japan? Japan actually made did make some progress in the Soviet Union, looks like. Which Japan? Do you have any more resources to give us, by the way? <laughs> well, if we no. ever if we were ever going to go on the Axis and take the North and Minnesota, now would probably be the opportunity. Well, um. <laughs> I don't know. We should. I don't know. Not with us missing guns everywhere. I don't think that's the right time. I mean, the UK still has up upwards of 197 divisions out there. the The France has 297. Netherlands has 20. Is there a way the of Swiss seeing? Have three. Let's see the what? I'm sorry. The consolidated casualties for the Battle of New York, because there's loads of separate New York attacks, because there's always one after the other, so you went to your consolidated one. Uh, maybe if you went to the Field Marshal? Field Marshal. Like, if you don't, if you go to We Don't Guns or something? Or maybe not. No, nah, it's all... No, I don't think you can. No. 13 million Allied casualties now. Well, they all got massacred in North America. They may have been ever so slightly bombed. Yeah, flat in New York. <laughs> New York's going to take forever to rebuild now. Oh my god, Mordred, why? <laughs> well, all the civilian factories are repaired already. I wasn't hitting the factories, remember, targeted. Alright, two days until the Pershing is done. Nice. But we're skipping right over that and going for the modern tank, the Patton. And then yeah. variating that up, so... So I, I was I would still stick with the M six A one as okay. the the tank just to keep the the product the the efficiency up so that we have more there's more numbers of them. Okay, 
the other thing that we may want to research are better ships so we can actually start wrestling the Atlantic back properly. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do the Fargo class, which will become the People's Cruiser Mark IV, or Mark III. No, yeah, Mark. we'll, we'll, we'll call it Mark IV anyway. Cool. The number three is two capitalists. Well, don't worry about... I've already got my troops garrisoning the south. Uh, it's mostly just so I can spread them out. So they're not, like, okay. taking attrition anywhere. Actually, why don't... Why don't I actually start island hopping then? Go for into it. the into the uh, Caribbean and stuff. Ready to move. Yeah, I've got all the garrisons covered. Plus I'm training troops right now, so it's all good. Alright, from Miami to what is this here? Bahamas. Strategic Bahamas. We also need to garrison Australia because of the resistance there. I'll get the commissars out there. <laughs> Actually, now the infrastructure is pretty much repaired, I might start just churning out oh. some more civilian factories. Why? Why civilian factories? So we can get more military factories built. It won't be many. Because I think some of them actually got destroyed, because we used to have like 10 stacks of 15, now we're down to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Well, really, we're having a resource problem. We're not having a military factory problem right now. Like, we're so our carry naval bombers aren't being built right now, and our strap bombers aren't being built. Yeah, I mean, we're we're about as good on resources as we're going to be. With actually, actually if, 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 if you want to, actually, if you want to make some synthetic plants so we can make our rubber shortage go away, that'd be fantastic. That can certainly be arranged. Because I, I did research a bunch of the... Well, not a bunch, but I'm, I'm, I've been researching every so often some of that rubber tech, so... That's the thing we got. Well, we're going to deploy the extremely famous rubber plants of Illinois, so Indiana, wonder. Kentucky, and Tennessee. You're going to make some cannolis because reasons? I'm sure it has nothing to do with us talking about Italian cuisine for, you know, sporadic <laughs> periods during the past hour. I'm sure it's got nothing to do with it. I'm sure everything's fine. Uh, Cuba next. Oh, that's a point. We do still want to take Cuba, especially if we're going to do modern tanks. They are a real... Actually, do they use tungsten or chromium? Chromium. Then they are a very big chromium hog. Yeah, they well, are four each. Regardless, then, we're going to want to jump through the Bahamas and stuff first and then hit... Actually, how long is this war goal good for on Cuba? Wait, we don't have it anymore, do we? I don't think we have the war going on Cuba anymore. Oh. Actually, I'm I, think not... it, I think it disappeared. I'm not surprised by that. <laughs> I mean, it's not like we had to, you know, fight for our lives or anything through the American continent. <laughs> we were so close. I, I was about ready to give up. I was, like, washing my hands of it. I was like, oh, fine. If I take direct control, I wonder if I can uh, salvage this. So, yeah. Don't use field marshal lines. They're terrible. Disappointingly so. Disappointed. Disappointed. You know what, if the UK is down to 30 ships, I wonder if we can start importing stuff from the Soviets now. <laughs> oh, hang on. Are they close there? Mordred, Mordred will not let that go. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm trying to get sources of steel. But I think the Soviets have closed their market. Because, yeah, they have. Wait, I'm sorry, Noel Boleslav. I don't have disappointed entered yet, is a thing. I'm sorry. Stop yelling at me. Stop exporting over steel. I mean, Abdul makes a good point, is that, we, you know, it might be a good idea to just switch to a closed economy. Uh, possibly. We're getting 47 we factories from trade right now. We we extract eleven hundred ninety four. We are exporting nine hundred fifty five of it. Uh, six hundred. Oh yeah, we're only exporting three hundred of that. Uh, yeah, we could probably go down one more level. So from free trade to export, one hundred fifty points. So it's like six days. Well, twelve days. Fine. 
Actually, no, I'm going to go ahead and stop construction repairs so we can get the points real quick, and then we'll uh, we'll go from there. There, so that should be like three days. Cool. Then we'll go export focus. Or export or limited. Good news, everyone. The commissars are all fully trained. <laughs> Thank God. Now they too can oppress politically everywhere. <laughs> Yeah, maybe export focus. Uh, export or limited? We'll try export, export first. Export. Okay. Uh, we're now just down the rubber. We've got all the steel we need then. Yeah, we can stop importing it. Though I am greatly tempted to not do that. Uh, <laughs> Damn it, Morgan. We're just hogging it, because if... Oh, actually, France has got a whole ton on the uh, market. I was going to say, if we're buying it all, then no one else is getting it either. So yeah, now it really is just rubber, which I'm building synthetics for. Excellent. Excellent! People steal for people's people. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. But Mordred <laughs> is overriding my, my trade ministry stuff, so I don't know what to tell you. All right. In a week, then, I'll be able to launch my naval invasion across several different islands in the Atlantic here, just off the coast of Florida. Cool. Yes, One motorized yeah. division survived that war. One. Yes, Ouch. So. Well, I'm actually going to throw... There's a couple of factories. Civilian factories need to be repaired. I'm going to throw those at the top. Because those should repair pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. Should. Yeah. They'll get done quick. They'll get done quick. And three, two, one, go. And three, two, one, go. There we go. Away! Everybody go. Go. Three, two, one, go. There you go. Invasion, proceed. Ah! <laughs> oh, some of these landings are not going very well. do Actually, do we have any Marines left? Or are they all dead? We have two. It's the uh, mm. Cyan guys. Take them if you need them. Oops, too many. Oops, not cavalry. Okay, I think we're going to start training some people's fist divisions. And basically replace the um, motorized with those. Then when we have access to the modern tanks, we'll replace the light tanks with that. Alright. We need more marines. That can be arranged. If you, want, if you want to train some marines, that'd be great. Because that's going to really help in this island hopping. Because I got repelled really hard off these islands. <laughs> no. Much to my shame. Uh... Look at that American industry chug right along. La da 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 da. Yeah, we're short so many guns. We're short artillery. Just one or two. It'll be fine. I am I am uh, researching a better heavy fighter. I think right now too. I don't know what the range yeah. of our strategic bombers is. Not far enough. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I could hit the Caribbean. Oh shit, you should flatten all the ports. That's what I was thinking. I, I heard I heard that was a really good trick. I saw that done once somewhere, I'm pretty <laughs> sure. Alright, let's flatten some ports. 
and some air bases, so they can't fly back. Although that seems really gamey. Flattening ports. No air bases, because then they can never send up fighters, oh. so they can never counter you. So I'm not going to do it because that just feels broken. It makes sense, but it feels broken. It's too easy to do. Uh, also, that airbase needs to be bigger. Raiding party! Black Fireforge, thank you very much for the raid. Hello, everyone. Man, I'm being raided loads today. <laughs> Well, you know. They see a Viking, they want to emulate the Viking. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> Will the USSR let us join the common turn? No. Yeah, that's not happening. Apparently we did some bad things once or twice. Harsh leader, career officer, connected old guard, harsh leader, infantry officer. Yeah, some of our random generals probably have a fair amount of experience now. Orders. There's a few of them that can be uh, promoted. I'm going to go ahead and promote Alexander Patch here, which he's been leading infantry pretty often. Ah, Morris Rose can be upgraded. To what? Guerrilla fighter. None of these other traits just ever become available. Though actually he's not that far away from infantry leader. British Parliament debates intervention in Benelux. <laughs> UK declares war on Netherlands. That would be hilarious. <laughs> Uh, the field marshal, William Simpson, he's in charge of my stuff here. Uh, charismatic organization first. I'm going to give him the offensive doctrine, actually, is what I'm going to do. Okay. Okay, I, give him, I can give him a charismatic as well, because we got the command points for it. So I'm just going to go and eat those 30 right there. Oh, I can do that for um, Griswold, too. I'll give him uh, charismatic. Then Edward Brooks is there under your command, too. Yeah, he didn't have any things that I wanted. He just has a guerrilla fighter, which not really worth it. I think I'm going to take infantry expert with Griswold, too. Although ambusher plus defensive doctrine could be interesting. Plus 10 max entrenchment, and then you entrench faster. Nah, infantry expert. We're on an offensive footing now. Probably. Hopefully. Well, we've regained 6,000 infantry equipment since the last time I checked. There's still 44,000 outstanding, though. We're making almost 200 a day, though, so, because, so, I mean, we'll get, we'll get there, eventually. <laughs> eventually. Almost. Eventually. Someday. We're working on Someday. it. Someday. In the meantime, though, uh, Scrabble? <laughs> <laughs> My queue up some more. Uh, thingy thingies. That was really descriptive, I know. <laughs> Do the thing with the thing. Plus the thing, you know, with the thing. Yeah, yeah. Synthetic refineries is what I was trying to say. 